All right, so slightly different kind of video today. We are going to be testing the difference in penetration between M855 green tip 556 and standard come on standard ball ammunition for a target got these two old steel wheels they don't hold air anymore uh, figured these will be a pretty good uh, pretty good target uh, we'll get to see what the penetration looks like and we will be firing it out of a uh, 10.5 inch 556 caliber mass accelerator all right we're gonna be firing from about uh, 10 yards away the ball ammunition first All right, so the ball ammunition looks like we've got uh, solid penetration through one side of the steel. You can see the uh, remnants of the copper jacket on there. I sailed on through, and there you can see it tried really, really hard, but did not penetrate that second layer of steel. Uh, it did, however, leave a nice big bulge. Um, looks like we have, I'm betting that core broke into a couple of different parts because we've got two smaller impacts here and here. And there is a small bulge. You can see the paint rubbed off there uh, on that side. So now, reposition that so we're shooting a fresh spot. And let's go try the M855. All right, and the M855. Another hit. All right, let's see. Oh, here's our M855. See, I don't know if you can see, there's a little bit of copper jacket on there. If you look, looks like, looks like this one also split a little bit. You've got two smaller holes there. Got one, and then a second one at kind of an oblique angle, and then a little dent here. Looks like, yeah. And I don't think, I don't think we hit the second wheel. Doesn't look like we did. Now that punched a pretty clean hole, so let's try that 855 again and see if we can't, uh, See if we can't hit the second wheel as well. All right, this is going to be our second round of 855. Let's see if we can't uh, get it to hit the second wheel. Alright, a little bit low that time. It's definitely me pulling it, but uh, let's see. So, there's our main impact there. Again, see the uh, copper, copper jacket coming through. And it looks like get penetration here and here. Uh, 
looks like this is probably the main body of the round and that's the uh, that steel penetrator and then you can see it just splattered all over that second wheel no penetration no uh no dent yeah uh one thing that's probably pretty important to remember uh this is a 10 and a half inch barrel um you'll get much better terminal ballist or you'll, you'll get much better velocities out of a longer barrel uh but for now that gives you an idea of m855 versus ball